everybody. It's Diane Jarecki here at Readings by Diane, which is where you can find me everywhere that I am. Readingsbydiane.com. Buy me a coffee at Readings by Diane. YouTube at Readings by Diane. Instagram is the only one different. That's Readings by Diane 603 because there are other Readings by Diane. Go figure. Anyway, other Dianes. So, summer hit today out of nowhere up here in New Hampshire. Anybody from New England knows what I mean. It was spring and still kind of winter where we were having to run the furnace and bam, out of nowhere, summer came. So I was trying to paint something today outside in a parking lot um, because it's where I have the thing I was painting <laughs> that I had to paint outdoors in that. And I had to stop before getting the full first coat on because I came really close to passing out from heat stroke. And I have the training to recognize it. And I knew I was in danger, but I pushed it until it was like, okay, I can't do this anymore. So yeah, <laughs> it's uh, crazy how hot it got. Um, like high 80s out there, Fahrenheit. And uh, just ridiculous. So I know people down in the South uh, and way out West are kind of used to that weather already, but we weren't used to it and ready for it yet here. So like my blood hasn't quite thinned out enough for it because we've still been chilly enough. It's uh, <laughs> just kind of really came at us. So Learn not to try to paint on a day like today. I'm waiting a few more until it's cooler out. And today we have, is that Hina over Hi. here? Yes, it is. Hi, Hina. What can I do Hello. for you today? Um, well, it's the first time I've been on the show, so um, thank you for calling. I just wanted a little bit more of an insight to maybe... Um, what I have coming in the next sort of six months, maybe to do with work. Okay. So work for the next six months. Yeah. All right. I'm going to use the Lenormand for that today, Hina. All right. That's okay. And a feeling like I'm going to get a little bit more of a concrete answer for you out of that when it comes to work because there are really good cards for that and then we can always do tarot as well it's a very okay. unusual thing, awesome. by the way. Yeah, very pretty yeah <laughs> thank you Okay. Well, one thing the cards are kind of verifying. <laughs> um, we don't usually ask about situations when everything is all really rosy and we expect it to stay that way. We usually ask when we're either going through a troubling period or we expect one is coming. And so the first thing that has come up here is the heart plus the clouds. So it's showing me a little bit of uncertainty here, either in whether or not you really love your work or in whether or not there's something coming where you are about to um, kind of possibly get hurt at work. Like there's, there's uncertainty there. The clouds are not necessarily a super negative card, but it's rather a, a an uncertain card kind of cloudiness, basically. I mean, right? Um, is that resonating so far? It is a little bit, yes. So um, I got made redundant uh, today from my existing job. Um, I have got a new role that I start later in the year. Um, and 
for some reason, um, my gut feeling is telling me that this new role may not work out for me. Okay, so an uncertain heart, definitely. All right. And then with the house and the letter. So the letter is usually about some kind of news or information can come as, um, it can be the bills uh, for the house. It can be an email. Um, it could also be that this is downsizing for you, like going to a smaller company. But I feel that there is definitely something coming your way information wise and it's followed by the key. So I do feel that with these three together, that what we have here is that you're going to be hearing something that is going to be good because we have the key in the next six months. All right, and that this has to do with maybe a smaller business because like the tower would be a big business, like a really large corporation. The house would be a small business, like almost even a cottage industry or working from home being self-employed kind of work. Well, but, go ahead. No, I was just going to say that the job that I'm starting in summer is actually with a large corporation. So I'm not sure where the reference to the small company is. Okay, so like I said, small company or it could mean being able to work from home? Yeah, yeah. It is a remote role, to be fair. Okay, so... And then the bouquet with the snake though within this gift there is something that is going to be trouble um just just so you know so i feel like this is not going to i feel like your gut is telling you true um that this isn't going to end up working out uh because then for the surprise cards i have the scythe and the path or crossroads. So I'm, I'm really feeling the scythe can be about decisions and very sudden ones, but also about endings. And so I feel like it's saying you're going to end that particular path. So I feel like within the next six months, this new job is not going to end up working out and you are going to be job hunting again. So I'm just trust that gut feeling that you're having all right it doesn't mean don't move forward with it sometimes we have to go through something in order to get to the other side and to the, like the next thing you know sometimes the next thing won't come along without this thing happening and i feel like you still need to move forward with this um but there's going to be an issue and that you're going to end up putting an end to it and going on to doing something else. And I'm going to see what comes up here in the Oracle cards for that too. See what else Spirit has to say about this situation. With those. Because I kind of feel like the tarot isn't going to really give us a lot more information on this. I really feel like it's more the Lenormand and the Oracle. Right? Okay. Like I said, just hold on to that. Like everything happens for a reason. And I feel like this is the path to something better. Okay. So don't okay. like, don't shortchange that path. Just um, kind of be flexible. So so it's interesting. The first card is about coming to the edge. So I feel like again, like this position has to happen, but you're 
like your gut is putting you on edge for it. Like you feel, you already even feel like this isn't going to end up lasting for you. But that to take that leap, something else has to happen. And then Treasure Island. So kind of just look for the blessings within it in the meantime while you're there. All right? When when that trouble stuff starts happening, look for the blessings that you do have at this job. But understand there's definitely... Could you mention... Huh? Sorry, go on. I said, could you um, see what sort okay, of I... trouble that is? Or could you see a timeline of when that's going to happen? Well, that's... I, I can only say it's within that six months. Chaos and conflict is here, though. So that, to me, kind of describes the kind of trouble there is. So I feel that there is some trouble within the company and there may be a lot of upheaval happening. And then the surprise mm -hmm. card at the bottom of that is change in the wind. So that with the chaos and conflict, I feel like this is a company that's going through some changes, maybe going through some growing pains. And so... That's kind of why I'm feeling like you need to look for the blessings. But once you get in there and get settled, maybe start looking for that next uh, you know, position, at least after a couple of months. And I feel like you're going to know when it's time to do that. All right. Uh, I feel like when the time is right, things are going to start coming your way. And you're going to know. Yeah. Okay, so don't like... The situation that you're describing sounds like um, the job that's just made me redundant. Yeah, well, it may also be this one you're moving into from what I'm seeing here, okay? So, okay. because it's in the future stuff. But it may be a okay. few months down the road before you start to see it. All right, Hina, just don't, like, don't be troubled by that. Just understand that things will end up working out for the best in the end. All right? Okay. All right. Have a great day. Thank you, everybody. And again, you can find me at readingsbydiane.com. And I hope everybody has just an absolutely amazing day and if you're in the northern hemisphere enjoy your summer <laughs> all right bye